Good evening, Southeast Texas. Getting a little bit of a break right now, but there's still the potential we could see some additional rainfall coming up as we're watching a front off towards the west. Notice the rain's picking up along that front. Otherwise, uh, fairly quiet right now as far as rainfall amounts. We've seen as much as almost two inches over towards southwest Tech, southwest Jefferson County and a few tenths of an inch up towards the lakes area. So again, it's been mainly towards the coastline. Current temperatures were at 57 in Bevel Oaks. Bill reporting 55 just over an inch. It's 58 in Orange and 56 into Port Arthur on the Kubota Beaumont Tractor Weather Watcher Network. In Woodville, Travis Smith reporting 53. Over in Warren, Jim at 55, he picked up over an inch of rainfall and in Jasper currently 55 degrees. Boy, it is really cold up into the Texas panhandle. Look at that. 29 into Amarillo, 47 into Dallas. Temperatures still fairly mild in the 50s and 60s ahead of the front along the Texas coastal bend. But look at all that blue over in towards northwest Texas. Temperatures running 15 to 20 degrees colder than 24 hours ago. As this front continues to push on off to the east, look at the flakes flying up in the Texas panhandle. That cold air is going to be draining on in behind that front that moves through our area coming up late tonight. In the upper levels of the atmosphere, this upper low is what is creating the snow and dragging that front into our area. Then it looks like as we head through the uh, Friday, the weekend looks pretty quiet until this comes in Sunday into Monday. This will bring us another cold front, but no rain is expected with it because there's just not going to be a lot of moisture behind this latest front that's coming through tonight. Modeling really adamant about uh, ramping up showers uh, across the area late tonight as that front goes by. Then as the winds swing around behind the front uh, towards the northwest, we'll erode the clouds. We'll start off with some clouds in the morning, and then by the afternoon, we ought to see mostly sunny skies. But you're going to need jackets in the morning. You can leave the umbrella at home. It's going to be a chilly day with highs mid to upper 50s. On the Gulf of Mexico, a small craft advisory is in effect tomorrow morning for choppy seas around 3 to 5. We'll see a northwest wind at 15 to 20. Our forecast tonight, we'll go with the latest modeling. Could be a bust. May not see it. But right now, about a 70% coverage of rain. Uh, lows in the lower and middle 40s lakes, mid to upper 40s in the triangle. Once the front goes through, could see some gusts here in the triangle to uh, 20 miles an hour tomorrow. Morning clouds, afternoon sun. You'll need jackets and coats with highs mid to upper 50s. Extended forecast. Quiet weather coming up on Friday. Some chilly mornings. May see some more frost coming up Saturday morning. All you pant plant lovers need to take care of that. Sunday, our next cold front comes on in, and that will just continue our cool, dry weather conditions through early next week.